We did have some racist news, but we I don't feel like talking about that shit. But <laughs> did you see the the story? I guess a lady went to a pool, not from the story that from last week talk, when uh, when they said another white one? dude. Yeah, it was another one. So I guess the lady lived in like a community, and you needed like a key card or some shit like that to get into the community pool. Uh huh. And some white dude just stopped her and said, like, let me see your key card. Let me see your ID. Random ass white dude that probably lives in the community. Yeah. I swear to God, this video just made, that video, and like, just the last things that's been happening with Permit Patty, Barbecue Becky, uh, uh, the hotel, the, the, the other hotel where motherfuckers asking, did your kids take a shower before they hopped in the, in the, in the pool? This shit. Bro, at some point in time, I really want a white person to fucking try me. <laughs> at this point, how I'm feeling right now with this shit, bro, I because re- something else happened too this week. I just can't remember what the fuck it is, like offhand. Yeah. Something else happened, but I just can't think. At this point, I'm really just waiting on a white person to try me. I, 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 I he, he gonna be waiting. Yeah, I know. It's, I know it's not gonna happen. <laughs> I know it's not gonna happen. <laughs> no, because they're they're more inclined, like. All these, well, except for that, the situation with the barbecue Becky and shit. Like, they're more inclined to, I want to say, confront uh, African American black females mm-hmm. more than like <clears throat> us. Yeah, because they feel like true. We're hostile and we gonna fucking I'm gonna fuck them up. Fuck yeah. them up. <laughs> <laughs> I dare you to call me monkey. I'm gonna turn the fucking. Uh, Fuck Caesar and this bitch. <laughs> you know what it is. Right the apes, guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna show you a monkey, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what it is, though. Like, I think, I think, I think white people think black people are magic. Mm. I think they think we sorcerers or some shit. I seen some shit. That's what I watched this week. Dion Hughley. Was on uh, Big Boy's Neighborhood. Uh-huh. He had he did an interview. I love watching D.L. Hughley. Yeah, that's like the way he talks. Too, man. So he was saying this thing about black people, since we're on the subject. He was saying this thing about black people. He's, he was saying, like, for some reason, white people think that black people don't need as much shit. Like, say me and you get sick. Mm-hmm. We're black. He was saying, like, some hospitals will only give us, like, having a prescription because they feel like black people are just so strong and they can just overcome whatever. <laughs> And white people, they'll get the whole type thing, like whole like whole medication, medication and everything like medication. that, because they probably need it more or some shit like that. Yeah. They just feel like black people, are, like black people are just like so strong, like Mentally, they don't need. Physically. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. what he was saying. That's exactly <laughs> what he was saying. Like that we we don't need as much as like other races need or some shit like that. Which is. And he was explaining mm-hmm. that shit. Just anything. Yeah. Just like, any. Just anything. Like not even just as far as medication and shit like that. I just use that as example because that's the only thing I can really remember. But he was like, just far as anything, like black people are just so strong mentally, physically, and everything. Like you just said, like they don't even need like half, but like half, like like we'll figure it out or we'll be better or some shit like that. Right. He was talking about that shit, bro. Man, I love when DL Hughley just talks, man. I'm so upset. I I think I need fucking serious XM or some shit so I can get his radio station <laughs> or something, bro. I love when that nigga talk because, bro, he just says the most realest shit and don't give a fuck. Nah, he he got a he got a book coming out called, um, fuck what the name of the book is. It's called something, but it's, it's going to piss on white people off. <laughs> it's fact. It's El Facto. But yeah, man, I love when he talks, yeah. man. He just talks the most realest yeah. shit, bro. That, that shit be wild as fuck, though. But he had said some shit like that. That's what that's what just made me think about that shit off of what you said. That yeah, because like, yeah, like, yeah, like, like I, I don't know. <clears throat> <laughs> I, I just, I, I, I think that, like, they think we, like, magicians or something. Yeah, they think we're so human for some <laughs> they reason. They're so man. fucking scared. Know. Like, not all, like, some, like, some, yeah. like, people just, like, so uncomfortable where... Like, they just think, like, we, like, fucking sorcerers. Like, we in fucking Harry Potter or some shit. Yeah. And we just turning up shit. Like, yeah, man. Yeah, that shit's just, um, like. I know what? it's not going to happen, but please, please, please. <laughs> get from behind those keyboards and come try me. <laughs> <laughs> please, please, please. 